This is Grade 5, Module 5, Lesson 2. The objective is to find the volume of a right rectangular prism by packing with cubic units and counting. This lesson covers, st covers standards 5MD3 and 5MD4. This is problem 1B off the homework. The question says, how many cubes would fill each box if you were to cut this out and fold it to make three open boxes. There's three different problems. So if I were to cut this out on grid paper, fold it up, tape it, and fill it with cubes, how many cubes would fill in it? Now, if I'm just looking at this, the first thing I notice is my base. Okay, and this is my base right here. And I notice that I have one, two, three, four, five, six six cubes would be in my base. Now in this lesson, I learned I learned that if the if I know the bottom has six and I'm going to look at the flap. Let's look at this outside flap on the left. I can see that I have one row and then I have two rows or layers you can call them. So for my base I have six. I'm going to call this base and then for my layer, I have 2. I can multiply those two numbers together, and I would get 12. So the volume would be 12, or I could fit 12 cubes into this um, box. Now this is from question 2 on the homework, 2A. And this question reads, how many centimeter cubes would fit inside each box? Explain your answer using words and diagrams on the box. And of course, this is not drawn to scale, okay? So if I looked at this, I can see that there are three cubes going across. And then, so I would say that three, three cubes going across. And then I can see that there are two layers of them. So that means in this first row, I have one, two, three. And then the back row, I have four, five, six. Okay, so how many would it be all together? I would have six cubes all together. And for my explanation, I can say that I can see three cubes going across, or the length is three cubes, and the width is two. Three times two gives me six. That's how I'm finding this.